Tonight, Mayor Barry is also reacting to the new recording. Our team coverage continues with KOAT Action 7 News reporter Mike Springer live at City Hall. Doug, we talked to Mayor Richard Berry and City Council President Ken Sanchez about that recording. They both tell us this is the first time they've heard it, but they both find what was said disappointing. It's a quick talk Albuquerque police officer Keith Sandy had with State Police Sergeant Chris Ware. What do they got you guys doing? What do they got you guys doing? I don't know. The guy asked for State Police? Well, I don't know. The little dick? It happens just hours before Sandy and fellow APD officer Dominic Perez are accused of shooting and killing James Boyd. Some say the language used here points to an aggressive behavior by APD, a behavior that's questioned in a Department of Justice report finding APD had a pattern or practice of using excessive force. Mayor Richard Berry heard the recordings for the first time this week. We get paid by the taxpayers and we expect our folks to act in a professional manner. Uh, and they do almost all the time, and when they don't, uh, we have to be swift and decisive on taking action. Sandy's words may have also violated the city's code of conduct policy. City employees cannot say anything offensive about the public or their co workers. City Council President Ken Sanchez says he's disappointed by what was said. I was stunned. I think it's damaging to the Albuquerque Police Department. And it's very difficult to really comment on this case because it's still an ongoing investigation uh, by the FBI. Both the mayor and Sanchez say they hope the Department of Justice does a thorough investigation in this case. Reporting from City Hall, Mike Springer, KOT Action 7 News. There is no official time frame for when the Boyd investigation may be complete. Today, the road rage victim whose complaint led to the conviction of Rio Reba County Sheriff Tommy Rodella is speaking publicly 